Great. Thank you very much, uh, gentlemen. May I request you to remain seated uh, as I uh, request Mr. Anandan Padmanabhan, CEO of Badwani Institute for Artificial Intelligence, for the closing remarks. Wow. Well, I don't know. I wish it could go on. Interesting, inspiring, and insightful, of course. But because you know they have that finite time. Thank you so much, Bill, Rishad, and uh, Mr. Khan, uh, for your time and sharing all your insights. You know, I've had the privilege of uh, working under Bill for more than 18 and a half years at Microsoft Research, and his interest and passion for technology for social good is not new. Back then, you know, I got an opportunity to set up a Microsoft Research Lab in India with that as one of the main themes, and that hasn't changed. A couple of years ago, I got an opportunity, thanks to the Vadwani brothers, Sunil and Ramesh, to set up a new institute uh, doing AI for social good, and that's come up well, was launched by the Honorable Prime Minister last year. We've grown, we've been working with government thanks to the partnership of Niti and the ministries. And today, we are also getting funded by the Gates Foundation. But we know, and I think Bill knows more than anybody else, and Rishad knows also, technology is not the cure-all and end-all uh, for social development. It requires human effort, human systems, governments. And to this, I'm really grateful, the proactive, pro-technology, forward-looking, open and collaborative nature that we find in the ministries and the governments today, in the halls that we go to, we are always welcome when we talk about AI, there's an excitement, and thanks to Niti for its leadership in, in bringing AI for social good. But ultimately, it's not technology, it's not just governments, right? The government alone can't solve the problem. All of you, many of you I know are from the social sector organizations, toiling away in the field, implementing programs, and AI will come and help you. I mean, I'm not going to solve all your problems in one day, but be sure that this technology will come and make a difference. Why? Because you know, one of the biggest challenges in social development is the lack of capacity in the front end. We don't have enough doctors, we don't have enough agriculture experts, we don't have enough financial experts. The poor people suffer the most because of lack of knowledge and lack of expertise. That's exactly where AI can help. Imagine a day when every frontline health worker carries an health app uh, that allows them to diagnose and treat and you know, start giving advice and triaging. That will be the day when we'll see the light. Thank you all for being here. Thanks, Mint, for organizing this visionary series. Thanks, Bill, Rishad, Amitabh Khan, for being the first in the series. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.